Razorback gymnastics team hosted LSU and Barnhill for a pink meet. The gymbacks started off the meet on vault, landing a team score of 49.25. Catherine Grable led the Razorbacks with a 9.875. Stephanie Canizaro, Scarlett Williams, and Amanda Wellick were close behind with 9.85s. As far as competition and the team progressing, I thought they did outstanding. I thought scoring was a little bit tighter than it has been, uh, more like postseason scoring. Uh, so, you know, it was good to see how the girls reacted to that. They stayed focused, they stayed working hard. So that was really great to see how mentally tough they could be. Moving on to the uneven bar rotation, Catherine Grable landed a 9.9. .9. Shelby Salmon followed close behind with a 9.85. Catherine Grable led the Razorbacks on beam with a 9.9. .9. Sydney Dillard and Samantha Nelson scored 9.825s. Grable took first on floor with a 9.95. I knew going into the last event that we were really close, so I knew I had to hit to win, and you know I just put it in my head like this has to be the floor team, and that's what I did. Posting scores of 9.825, Amanda Wellick and Heather Ellswick trailed close behind. For five consecutive meets, Catherine Grable took first place in the all-around competition. I think you know Catherine's just phenomenal. She is so talented and. You know, to have her keep winning the all-around week in and week out it is definitely um, exciting for her and for the program. Uh, she's definitely one of those special athletes out there, and, you know, um, hopefully the rest of the season will keep going her way. Next week, Arkansas travels to Florida to take on the number one Gators. Oh, we got to go down to Florida. We have to have a good away meet. Away meets are really important to our RQS. Uh, so, you know, we'll get back in the gym. We'll try to build on what we did tonight, uh, fix a few little errors. Uh, hopefully Bailey will be back in the floor lineup. She's had to rest her ankle a little bit, and that'll help us boost that score a little bit. Um, so, you know, we're, we're definitely excited to get down to Florida and face the Gators. You know, going up against number three, LSU, was a good preparation. But, you know, Florida is number one, and we're going to be um, at Florida, so we really have to really have to prepare this week in practice, and um, you know, keep working hard. The Razorbacks will be back at home February 21st to face off against the Kentucky Wildcats.